Hi, this is Zidane Tutorials and in this video we are going to learn how to add new fonts to Adobe Illustrator. So I have got this document or artboard in Adobe Illustrator with this text layer and if I select it I will find these settings on the top, the corrector settings and here I will have this drop down and uh, here I've got a lot of fonts available in, in uh, Illustrator and I could simply scroll or hover over these fonts to pick something I like and once I'm happy I'll click on it and that will get implemented. But what if I want to add more fonts to Adobe Illustrator uh, just to explore or maybe experiment. So in order to do, do that um, I need to clarify one thing first. So all these fonts which are available in your Adobe Illustrator are actually the ones which are already installed in your system uh, whether it is a Macbook or Windows. So in simple words all the fonts that are installed in your Windows or Macbook or laptop PC computer are the ones which will automatically get synchronized with Adobe Illustrator. So, in order to add new fonts in Adobe Illustrator, I need to install new font in my system. So, I'm going to do that. And for that, I need to go to my web browser and you will have to find some free font website and there are hundreds of those uh, available. Uh, you could find those via Google. So, at the moment, I am using the thefont.com, D-A-F-O-N-T.com. Uh, you could use any other uh, website of your preference. So it has all these categories and uh, and I could pick any any one of these. Let's say I go with this one and it will show me fonts related with that particular category and uh, I like this font at the moment. It's Dealer Plate California. Now before I install it, I need to show you if it's already available in my system or not. So I will select my font and I will go to D, uh, the fonts that starts with D, letter D. And uh, I don't have dealer California uh, here. Okay, so it's not available at the moment and we are going to make it available. So I will uh, go back to my browser and here I will click on this button that says download. I will click on it, it will get downloaded within seconds. Now this icon may appear different in your operating system, okay? So don't worry about that. It will be a zip file and you just need to uh, go to the uh, folder where it gets downloaded and you need to right click on it and extract the files inside that zip file. Even if it's, its icon appears a bit different. So you will get a, a folder with the same name like the zip file, like dealer plate underscore California, the same thing. I will open the folder and here you will look for uh, a file which has a format TTF or OTF. So you will need to look at that and you will double click on it and something like this will pop up. Here you will find this uh, install button on the top corner. You will click on it and within few seconds uh, this font will get installed in your system. Now in most cases uh, you will not have to reopen or restart your Adobe Illustrator in order to get that font but sometimes you may need to do that. So let's see if that's the case or not. So the name of the font is Dealer Plate California. So I'm going to go back to my Illustrator. I will click on my text layer and I will click on the drop down and here I will scroll down to the fonts which starts with D and here we go. You will see, you can see it is Dealer Plate California. It was not previously here. Now it is available and I could just simply use it like that. So I hope it was pretty clear that in order to uh, add a new font to Adobe Illustrator you need to add or install a new font in your system. It could be Macbook or Windows. So once it is installed in your system that will automatically uh, appear in the drop down list of Adobe Illustrator. So I hope uh, this video was helpful to you. Uh, do subscribe to this channel 
Thank you so much and have a nice day.